Hello everybody and welcome back to more Isaac. Today we're doing another curated run all to do with mini Isaacs. This one's going to be pretty interesting. So to start with, we have good old mum's purse to make sure we can hold two trinkets. And that's going to be paired with the dwarf cell to get a 50% chance to spawn a mini Isaac on hit. Along with the malformed pennies for a 25% chance to get a mini Isaac on picking up a coin. Then we've got giant cell, which is just getting a mini Isaac on taking damage. So even more mini Isaacs on taking damage. We then have the blindfold so that we cannot shoot at all. And then what's really going to make this is the book of love to spawn mini Isaacs. Uh, five to six each time for six charges. And the book of all books, which completely uh, sort of buffs different books so we can take a look now at our book here and at the start of every floor You gain mini Isaacs equal to the number of times you activated the book of love and we are also using um, A mod that makes it so that our mini Isaacs can adopt our tier effects. So we've got some pretty interesting stuff going on here Um of course, it is gonna be kind of tricky to start with when we don't have tier effects because our mini Isaacs are gonna be able to perish pretty easily uh, but we've got many ways to gain them, so we're going to be hoping for the best. What's going on with this door over here? What's going on with this door? We're going to be seeing what goes on, but so far, they're doing a good job. Uh, yeah, I don't know what's going on with this door. I've been feared upon entering the room. It's something to do with uh, God Mode Achieved, I think, which is kind of interesting. Oh my goodness. So I've, I basically, at the minute, I've really got to try my best to protect my mini Isaacs. Because if they die, I am without the ability to deal damage. So I've got to kind of be careful. I mean, that's a bad enemy right there for us. That enemy just gobbled up a few of our fellas there. We do not like that. We do not like that at all. But I'm hoping we can get some uh, really cool tier effects that pair nicely with the mini Isaacs and allow us to deal some extra damage. But we are going to get in some rooms where we need to take damage in order to gain mini Isaacs. Like, we are going to run out of them eventually and have to take damage to gain more. Like, right now, we've got one left. So, we are in a, a bit of a pickle here. A bit of a pickle. Oh, my God. I'm hoping, though, as we progress, it'll get easier and easier. The only thing is, is as well, as you can see, Mini Isaacs don't actually really follow me. But there you go. I took some damage and gained some more Mini Isaacs there. They don't actually really follow me. Um, they kind of do their own thing very much, so. Um, so... I kind of just got to get them near enemies and then just leave them to it. Once they get locked in on an enemy, they'll uh, they'll spend some good time killing them. There's another little mini Isaac there. We like it. We like it. And we're about to get a whole heap more after this room. Certain rooms are going to be really, really hard, though. That's definitely something to note. Like, some rooms are going to be, like, pretty easy for us. Other rooms are going to be really difficult. Um... I don't think there's any way I can I can increase the amount of uh, health my mini Isaacs have. Can you guys lock onto this guy? Thank you. So I can, now I can pop out a bunch more, and now we're in a much safer spot. And the boss we're really gonna want to um, we're really gonna want to have a chance. At, oh my god, have a chance to actually uh, be able to kill. So we're gonna want a lot of mini Isaacs. I have just realised that I'm unable to destroy poop, so that may come into play um, later on. Now I haven't actually seen how these guys will do against a boss yet. I mean the damage they're doing is pretty great right now, but. There's some bosses that I think can probably steamroll them pretty easily. And we just get this. Uh, we get some contact damage out of that, which is potentially nice. Uh, we want to quickly grab that half heart if we can. Yeah, so maybe I need to give myself something so that I can um, destroy poops. I don't know what that would be. Um, okay, I, I think I know. One second. I feel like this is somewhat on theme. I've given myself the finger so that I can destroy poops and stuff. It's not going to give us a ton of damage, uh, but I feel like, I don't know, I feel like it's kind of on theme having a bunch of mini Isaacs and then pointing at people with my little finger here. Because it doesn't do a ton of damage either, so it won't be helping us too much on enemies, so to say. Uh, but you can see we got a few mini Isaacs there because we used our book twice. Um, and Heart Shape Balloon is a pretty good one for keeping our health consistent here. Very, very nice to have. Of course, some items aren't going to make a lick of difference for us. So now we are able to do a little bit of damage, but it's still mainly going to be our mini Isaacs that are doing the brunt of the damage. Right, come on, guys. There's flies everywhere. Ah. Okay, our heart-shaped balloon dropped half a heart. That's something. We are back going again. Apologies about that. I had to do some work stuff. But we are here seeing if our mini Isaacs can do it. I'm really glad we've got this heart-shaped balloon, though. Because I think that's going to be really, really good for us in terms of, um, in terms of 
keeping our health reasonably high. Because we're going to be wanting to take damage fairly often. And basically, depending on how many rooms you've not taken damage in, depends on what the heart ends up dropping for you. That's also a really, really good card for increasing our HP. But yeah, I'm really, like, I know that the finger's not exactly the most on theme. But I'm really glad to have it just to make sure we can do something in terms of, uh... In terms of killing enemies, because otherwise we'd be in a bit of a sticky spot. Dude, this enemy is uh, proving to be pretty hard. Oh, we still got these bastards. I forgot to disable the god mode mod. Apologies. These guys are silly. I don't like them. They're, uh, they're funky little guys is what they are. Go, mini Isaacs. Go. Oh, we've only got one left. Okay, so this, this actually does give us something to use if we completely run out of mini Isaacs as well, which I suppose is pretty goddamn useful. Uh, I will grab that. Why not? And give us a heart, and two of those, and then we can pop some more mini Isaacs, lovely. Yeah, I gotta say, the finger gives us just that really small amount of damage as like a backup plan for when things don't quite go our way, which I think we really needed as well. So it makes sense. A. We, we would like to get some shop item that's going to allow us to get more money, um, because that's going to be more mini Isaacs, anything that's going to drop more money. I mean, deep pockets would be the, would be the one to look for, really. But yeah, our balloon is keeping us alive right now. Ow. Taking some bad damage, but honestly, it's giving us mini Isaacs, which is giving us power, so I'm happy. And like I said, we kind of need a lot of mini Isaacs for the boss. So I'm a little bit apprehensive about using my book earlier on in the floor, just in case. But in situations like this, there's a heart right there. We should be coming in here and hurting ourselves on purpose a few times. Kind of like you do with um with Tainted Lilith in a way. But we have, we have quite the army going on right now. Okay, these, these little dudes don't really understand this enemy. So they're having a hard time firing at him. Now, we, there you go. Once he starts moving, they, they, they understand. But yeah, we can kind of use the fact that um, we have extra HP on the floor to do a bit of extra damage to some enemies um, by getting some more mini Isaacs. It's kind of nice. It keeps our stocks nice and lively. These guys are also really good for protecting us as well. They absorb a lot of the incoming shots, which is pretty nice. We've got Steven here. Okay, they are they are doing a number on him right now. But that's not the only version of him we've got. Oh, dude. A lot of them just died there. We've only got three left. We do have some bombs to use if need be, and I think, in fact, I'm going to use a bomb right there. Really, copper bomb now? Okay, we needed the bomb there. Damage, I, I think, I think they will improve our mini Isaac's damage, if I'm right in thinking that. I think the way that it works is they just deal, like, half our damage or something per shot. Um... Does anyone want to tell me why I literally have every single curse that exists at once? Also, I didn't use my Eternity card. I am a goose. I am a goose. Yeah, does anyone want to tell me why I have literally every single curse that has ever existed? That is um, not something I would have expected. We got a mini Isaac heart there, which gave us a few more. Yeah, this is, this is apparently going to be a hard floor. Um... Everything's a champion, which we already did that challenge. I've got things firing, um, firing homing shots at me. I've got, I, I don't even know the totality of everything that's happening with all these curses. I don't know why that happened. I'm just going to blame God mode. God mode seems to be causing all sorts of strange issues. So I'm just going to blame God mode. These guys are all hooked up together and spawning stuff on me. Oh my God. This has been uh, not so easy. Also, we now have um, we now have Mum's heels plus um, the tooth. Ooh, we got another book here. Um, I guess I'll just pick it up for the bookworm. Yeah, I don't know if bookworm helps, but we have it now. Oh my god, everything's firing herming shots as well. This is not good. My goodness. Oh, this is... What has happened with this floor, man? What is going on? Who did I anger? Who did I anger for this to happen? Oh, man. I'm taking some bad damage right now. I don't even know where my balloon is. Dude, why has that thing got so much health? 
Oh, I'm, I'm a bit scared, I'll be honest. I'm a bit scared. Poops have the chance to be red poops now as well. Oh, this is... This floor has, has ruined us. What on earth happened with that bomb? Come on, Mini Isaac army. Why am I leaving trails of slippy poop? Is that a curse as well? Because that's really annoying. <laughs> It's not helping. Not helping at all. Right, while I've got a lot of mini Isaacs, I think I've got to go and do the boss. I am definitely going to be using bombs if I need to. But I think I might be okay, actually. I think these guys have enough knockback to uh, to stave this guy away from hitting me, maybe. They, they need more range. They keep firing for, for, like from a distance where they can't hit enemies, which is weird. Okay, but they did get him in the end. My goodness. Um, there's no... There's no door. There's no door here. Well, I guess we're leaving. What on earth happened on that floor, man? At least it didn't happen again. We got a planetarium this time. All enemies get converted into... Half soul hearts on use. Minus one heart container. Bosses take. Ooh. That's pretty intriguing. I'm going to hold on to that just until I find a room that's worthy. I realize that I need my book. But I'm just going to hold on to that until I find a room that I feel is, is worthy of using that on. Because I'm sure one will come along. Um... Might as well play the sack room while I've got some red hearts here. Not a ton, but something to work with. Yeah, so this isn't the room. Come on, boys. Get to it. <laughs> oh, this is a this is a challenge. I knew this one was gonna be not so super easy. This is a challenge. I'm gonna go and quickly pop another usage of the uh, of the old sack room here. One moment, I need to move my phone into somewhere where I can see my messages, just in case. Um, that's good. I don't know if that troll bomb will kill my mini Isaacs or not, but I'm. Really not e eager to find out, so I'm just not gonna bother finding out. But yeah, stem cells in the item room, kind of dookie. Not not the best. But the shot speed might be useful. The shot speed might be useful. Yeah, until we run out of mini Isaacs, I'm gonna. Oh man, look how many there is. I'm gonna hold on to this guppy's celestial paw thing until I uh, find a room that's worthy, which will probably be this next room here. Get him. Lovely. And then, yeah, this room here. Yep, I'll do it. Okay, it didn't actually kill all of them, which I'm surprised at. See, now I can't play the sack room, though, which, yeah, I didn't really think about that. Should have, probably should have done that after. Although, I could just get rid of the soul hearts to play the sack room. How far are we through? Oh, we got the Celeste. I, I, I honestly don't know why we got that. But, thank you? Dude, God Mode is a, is a weird mod. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. Really? Didn't get any of the payouts. Okay, fair enough. Fair enough. We've, we've become a celestial being. I don't really know why exactly. But we have now. Uh, ooh, we're firing like little homing shots. That's part of the celestial transformation, I guess. And mini Isaacs are firing like little little homing shots around me that linger. It's extra damage, so I'm not gonna bat an eye. This is uh it's been a pretty wild ride thus far. What we got going on in here. Ooh, yes, that's pretty good. I'll take that. And I'll buy the soul heart as well, thank you. Hey little fella. One second. 
we keep on moving on. So far, so good. We're not doing too bad. I mean, we've got a lot of mini Isaacs. We've got some we got some bees coming in now as well. The, 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 the mini Isaacs are indeed producing bees. Our mini Isaacs have changed hand now. They are um, flying ones, which is nice. Dude, the watery floor isn't good for the lag. I mean, obviously we've got the mod to reduce the visual lag, but the game is still running a little bit slower, as you can probably tell. But this is uh, a lot of tears going on. I think we've entered the point now where we're having a good time. Oh, my balloon popped but didn't give me any HP. I'm not sure why that, why that was. Kill him. Good, good, good. We can see like the old era mini Isaacs and the new era mini Isaacs. Combining into a beautiful yin and yang. The light and the dark. Get around there. I'm, I'm loving the fact that the bees item is working. Like I said, this I, this this mod that makes us a mini Isaacs adopt your tier effects. I will say it's a very laggy mod. I had to. I, I, the reason I don't use it day to day is because it is a laggy mod. But I thought with the um with the thing that we sorted out, uh the the like anti visual lag thing plus um on top of that for this episode alone, I thought it's worth giving a go. I don't know what's happening right now. You really managed to absorb your little fella there? Oh, no, no, you didn't. No, you didn't. It's right here. Kill it. Kill it now. Mini Isaac's having a real hard time on that room. They did not know what to shoot at all. Oh, the amount of damage they're able to do whenever everything goes to plan is uh, awesome. Also, them having flight. These, these, these fewer ones afterwards having flight is very, very nice. Ooh, Mozzie. Kind of a hard boss because I think it rushes. And yeah, that's going to kill a lot of mini Isaacs, but we uh, we managed to absolutely demolish him, so that's okay. <laughs> Gotta just line the wall here so the electricity doesn't bother us. It's a cool way of him dying, I like it. Ah! We did get a devil deal here, which I'll definitely check out. Are we going to get another floor with a billion curses? Right, what we got going on here? Uh, damage per red heart, uh, per half red heart held, release 10 fires from taking damage, that's pretty good. Um, after picking up this item each time, um, an item is picked up from the opposite deal, gain plus 2 damage, no penalty for picking up item from the wrong deal. 20% chance to replace slot machines with confessionals. Tears now arc and leave behind fire jets on collision, that seems hilariously bad for us, so I'm gonna take it. If all of these adopt that... Oh boy, I'm pretty sure they can do damage to us, so it's gonna be it's gonna be bad, which is why I took the boiling veins as well. Um, but yeah, we have we have a lot of mini Isaacs now. <laughs> oh yes, baby, they're doing it. They're summoning fires. Oh wait, I think they can hurt themselves. I might have to remove that item. I have a feeling they can hurt themselves. Let's let's just see. But if they can hurt themselves, that is monumentally bad. Are they doing okay? They seem to be doing okay for right now, so I'm gonna keep it for for now. If I find if I find my supply weirdly diminished of mini Isaacs all of a sudden, then we know what's happened. It's okay. It does seem to be hurting them, but it seems to be hurting them very minimally. Considering that a damage we're getting from it, I think it's worth it right now. But I, if, if it gets to the point where I'm just doing too much damage to my own mini Isaacs, I may have to remove that item. Which is a shame, because it's a cool item. The world. Oh, I like it. I like it. Got our shop here as well. And we got the nuke boys as well. I didn't realize they had herming on these little spikes. Okay, no, I, we, we have lost a lot of mini Isaacs to this item. I've just realized we have lost a lot. Right, unfortunately, remove, I think it's called like, yeah, Glory, uh, Gloriosa. 
Damn you. I liked that item as well, but it's just not plausible to keep that and not lose all of our mini Isaacs. I just, I don't know why the item does self damage. It's been like that for a long time and it obviously shouldn't do self damage. I'm pretty sure that's like a problem with the item. It's like not meant to, which is, yeah, not ideal. Got a secret room here. Could it give us an interesting item? Could give a steam cell. It did indeed give a steam cell. We also got a heart container on the floor. Yet again, another weird thing from God Mode. Another eternal heart. We're liking that. The bees. The bees are helping out. Vanilla wafer's pretty good here as well. Ow. I got hit there. I didn't mean to. About to get another batch of friends. There you go. Like, you're doing a good enough job, I think, at the minute. It's just certain rooms and certain enemies definitely uh, cause some problems. I've got five fire rate and nothing to do with it. Um, any enemy who takes damage gains dread temporarily. Enemies with dread take damage over time. Ooh. Ooh, not that we need that. That's a pretty cool item. I like the idea of that. Right. For these guys, resummon back into their bodies. <clears throat> Let's get them taken care of. Another mini Isaac from our malformed penny. Lovely. Ooh, a little totem guy. Oh, man. Them having flight is it's just so good. And we get one of the hearts as well. Lovely. Dude, the mini Isaacs are pushing my bombs around. That is not what I wanted, thank you. Not what I wanted. Okay, you're gonna be annoying, aren't you? Just get up and take your take your beatings like a man. Butt bombs? Pretty decent. I mean extra bombs is nice, but just I think butt bombs for like a little bit of safety in rooms where there's a lot of enemies, we can pop a few of them down. Do some damage with them. I like it. Right, we've not got many mini Isaacs to fight the boss with, so let's try and do some extra rooms to um, pop our active before the boss here. The good thing is we can let the bees do a lot because they have a lot more range. The, the big thing about the mini Isaacs is they've got to get really up close and personal. So for certain enemies, that means they just get destroyed. Right. Good thing is as well, because of our book of all books, at the end of every floor, we're getting more and more. Um, we can pop this straight away. At the end of each floor, we're getting more and more mini Isaacs because we use because uh, of how many times we've used the book of love. So the later into the game we get, the more mini Isaacs we're going to get, which is ideal because I don't believe the mini Isaacs health goes up at all. Um, but obviously the enemy's damage and health does go up. So they're going to last less time. I was about to say, I don't really remember what he does there. The nukes aren't nice. He is really making it hard for us to get close to him right now. But I think we're doing a good job of it so far. I will take some poison damage if I need to. Hey, we got him, we got him. The mini Isaacs shall prevail. Wow, that's so useful for us. God damn it. How many mini Isaacs could we get here? Like eight, I think? Nine, ten, something like that? Yeah, look at that. So many of them. So it really gives, it bolsters our start of each floor heavily. Puts us in a really good spot to start each floor. We got this lovely little room here, which the mini Isaacs are entirely confused by. Yet another room sponsored by I don't like fun.com. I don't know who who out there the malicious weirdo is making these rooms. I apologize to that person, but I'm sorry. I just don't understand it. You've wasted your own time. You've wasted my time, and you've wasted the viewer's time. Congratulations. 
Ooh, that guy exploded and killed a good few mini Isaacs there. Not ideal. Okay, I'm doing a good job of not taking damage though at the moment. I'm liking that. I'm getting a lot of eternal hearts from my uh from my thingy, which is giving us more damage with boiling blood, so it's working out for us. Up to seven damage at the minute. It's pretty good. Get out of here, pop that bad boy, another six of these fellas. It, do, it does seem that we're at the point now where, like, just as we're starting to run out of mini Isaacs, we get a new batch. So, I do, I, I am worried about the later flaws of how that's going to go. But hopefully, we should have a larger army at the start of each floor, which carries us through more rooms sort of thing. So, in that regard, it shouldn't be as bad. In that regard, we should be okay Care of you. Keeper's Kin. That's actually not bad. I'm hoping we get a, like a tier effect modifier at some point here. That'd be really nice. Two trinkets. Unfortunately, we are all full up on the trinket front game. Interesting room. Kind of weird. So what am I meant to do here? Pick up this guy and slam him. Yes, I am. That is the intended idea of that room. Dude, how am I picking up so many coins and not getting mini Isaacs? There's a 50% chance I picked up like seven coins and I didn't get one. It is sad. Okay. Just, oh, I got hit. The fires. Get some spiders ready for the boss. Good, good, good. This is going to be kind of a hard boss. We, don't, we didn't have a charge. I really should have gone and got one, shouldn't I? We're probably going to run out of mini Isaacs here. I'm going to bomb some of these rocks here to get some more spiders. Keeper's Kin is actually a really good grab here. And I think I can do this. Yes, I can, baby. Okay. So I can grab that and that. Devil deal, what do you hold for me? Sadly, absolutely nothing. Apart from Guppy's paw, which also not very useful for me. Thank you. To the next floor. So unfortunately, we didn't get any super wacky tier modifiers that I was hoping for. This has still been an interesting run, though. We've still got some cool stuff working with our with our little fellas. And we're still having to sort of manage and keep on top of them, which I think is kind of fun. We did see Gloriosa working quite nicely, but... I, um, and I suppose the Celestial Transformation is working quite nicely for us as well. But yeah, we did see Gloriosa working for us, but that's just uh, one that was kind of, kind of risky, kind of scary. Oh, wait. Do my mini Isaacs take beam damage? No, they don't. Okay. Some some familiars take, like, like these take beam damage, and charmed enemies take beam damage. Some don't. These don't, which is very much ideal. Otherwise, they would they would be all perished extremely quickly, I'd think. And also the B item's working for us, too. I kind of forgot about the B item. That's, B item's just kind of chilling there, doing its own thing. Dude, the Eternal Hearts are beautiful. We're getting so many of them. Realistically, on this floor, I should have just popped the Emperor. I think on the next floor, I probably will. Because that, that also means we have, like, our most mini Isaacs for the boss as well. So I think I will do that on the next floor. Just pop the Emperor straight away. Go, my bees and spiders and mini Isaacs. We've got the, the, little, the little critters uh, collection here going on. That's doing a slam attack. I'm kind of pulling my mini Isaacs all over the room here, which isn't ideal. I think we're heading the right direction, though, which is something I can't normally say on the womb. Beautiful. Oh, hello, one of you. Uh, you want my book? I'm sorry, it's mine. 
I'll be keeping it. Thank you, sir. Unfortunately, I think I was completely wrong about going the right way here, wasn't I? That's a shame. It really felt like the right way. I was sadly mistaken. Oh, wait, no. Maybe not. Maybe not. Oh, my God. These enemies... Uh, chasey enemies are pretty bad for us because they can kill our mini Isaacs very easily. Thank you, B, for taking that guy out. Hey, we were right. Okay. Beautiful. And then boss time. We can use our active here as well just before the boss, which is lovely timing. And we got another mini Isaac from a penny there as well. Oh, it's this guy. It's the corpse flower guy. Still can't really remember how this guy works. But we're not going to have to figure out because he's dead. And we got ourselves soul food, which is actually pretty good for us here. Devil deal, please give me a tear effect or something cool. Uh, sadly, you didn't. Ah, I'll play. I'll play this dude in the hopes that I get something interesting. Really? <laughs> That's not interesting. Right, Emperor card straight away. We'll have an absolutely insane army of mini Isaacs here. Oh my goodness. Uh, for some reason, on the wrong floor layout, like tile behind us, which is strange. Oh, dude. These guys are going to get massacred by her attacks. It's a good job we have so many of them. I throw out a butt bomb there because it's going to do damage even if it misses. Can we skip the last phase? Can we skip the last phase? Yes, we can. We have the power. We have the power. We did manage to glitch out the hush fight last time. The problem is, if I go to the hush fight and that doesn't work, I'm basically burned. I'm going to try it out. I'm going to try it out. So I got my pile of keys. I got myself... Uh, the wax was pretty good last time we saw that. Oh, is that a Yera? It is a Yera. Oh. Although... I can at least, uh, I can at least duplicate this stack of keys thing, which is kind of nice. Now I get more attempts at this, this whole thing. I should have duplicated the items as well, really. That would have been a good idea. Pop. Pop could be interesting here. Right, so what did I do? I did it, like, right here, didn't I? Yeah, there you go. <laughs> I did it. I broke it already. Awesome. It's, it's kind of stupid that it lets you use keys in areas that... Don't let you use keys. Ooh, yeah, this wax plus pop is uh, popping off. We got some sort of room here. Oh, dude, yeah, I like this wax item a lot. Certainly helping out. I really like this idea with this this floor. It's cool. Although I I, I do think it's funny that it's so easy to just not fight hush. But if I'm if I've got God mode installed. I might as well take advantage. Right, we have another set of keys over here. Come on, my mini army. I very much want this to uh, re-roll some shop items, I think. No mini Isaacs for me. Yeah, we'll come back and grab that. So let's do that. That's not bad, I'll take that. We do lose some damage there, but... We take damage all the time, so I think that's worthwhile. Right, we come and grab this, and we do the same on the other side and see what extra rooms we can get. Yeah. Um, why is my pop-pop not working now? Weird? Strange? I am confused. They are not doing pop-pop tiers anymore. Hoping by the next floor they will be.
Good, I'm getting so many extra red keys as well. It's a wild idea, but I like it. It expands the floor a lot. There's a lot to see. Another Eternal Heart, lovely. Last few red keys. Okay, Pop Pop's working again. It's just... Oh wait, so... I think if I'm holding fire, Pop doesn't work, and then when I'm not holding fire, it does or something? It's, it's weird. What's alive? I couldn't tell what enemy was, was actually living there. They're having a really hard time killing these enemies right now, aren't they? Well, that was a lot of fun. We are going to go to the error room now, thank you. We'll make our way to the little error room and skip the whole fight, because I know how to glitch it. <laughs> I'm a glitch abuser. I, feel, I do not feel bad about that at all. Yay! <laughs> Hey, it's Finger 2 Electric Boogaloo. Why not? Another book. And the poop. Not the greatest collection of things we could have gotten there. But a second finger. Ooh, not that we need the money, but... That's just going to be nice to have. Right, up we go. We're going to spawn a lot of Mini Isaacs. I don't even know if there's a limit to Mini Isaacs. But we're going to be getting a lot on this floor. <laughs> yes. <laughs> But, it, like I said, it, it makes sense, though, because, like, the later into the game you go, the more you want. There is a... a lot of lag in this room. <laughs> when they fire, it uh, causes some issues. Yeah, I'll be leaving, thank you. No thank you on the, the whole dead-end front. <laughs> oh, as soon as they start firing, it's it's all the it's all the the the, the tear effects from the coins. You can see the game just plays slow-mo though now. It's visually still watchable and still playable, which is nice. I'd rather just play slow-mo than laggy. Oh hello, boss man. <laughs> it's just there's so many of them. Producing so many coin tier status. I, I don't know why, like I said, there isn't a mod yet that does that just disables the on-hit effects of tiers. Because I feel like that's one of the biggest causes of lag. Is the, uh, when, when a tier hits an enemy. And it seems like that'd be something that'd be really easy to just disable. But maybe I'm wrong. Because I, I feel like the mod would exist now if it, if it was. But yeah, do you know how I said this mod was pretty laggy if you don't play with this, this thingy mod on? Yeah, I wasn't jerking. I got a bomb in there. It'll explode one day. There you go. Are we going to get a decent item out of him? But yeah, now we get more mini Isaacs from the pennies that drop. We got the mitre. It's kind of nice. This is a good combo. Despite the lag, this is a good combo. Eternal heart, thank you. Rooms like that are ideal. Just waltz on through. There's a soul heart in there that I need to go back for. More mini Isaacs. You can never have too many friends. Absolute swarm. Absolute swarm. It's going to be... The, the bosses are going to be kind of rough. <laughs> I admit the bosses are going to be a bit rough. Oh, they keep firing at those things of which they cannot kill. Luckily, I can swiftly escape. Oh, wrong way. Another Eternal Heart. Dude, this balloon... Once we've once we got to the point where we had enough mini Isaacs for it to be hard for us to take damage, the balloon has been carrying us for HP. And damage somewhat as well. A lot of our damage up has come from having more red hearts from the boiling uh, veins, I think it was called. Take care of him, boys. That was another thingy there. What on earth are you? 
I don't care for you, whatever you are. Yeah, there was, a, there was a, another soul heart back here. I need all the HP I can get my grubby little hands on right now. But yeah, because of this lag, it's one of these reasons I didn't want to do this run before. But now, even though it is laggy, it's at least watchable and playable. I can at least see what's going on. Dude, the amount of mini Isaacs here is obscene. Dude, this enemy is taking way too long to kill. Oh, no, the bombs. They don't do exactly what I want them to at all. Managed to blow that up, though. That's nice. Battery charge? Yes, please. When we were only on one charge previously, that's not bad at all. Some of these enemies, it's, it, it's insane how fast it kills them. Here we go. I was going to say, where's the boss at? We found him. Ooh, I don't know what that guy is. I feel like if he touches me, it'll be bad, though. Don't crush my mini Isaacs. They're keeping him at bay. They are keeping him at bay. Oh, my God. Where's the hands gone? The coming down mod is, uh, is struggling. No! You went for all my boys! Right before the boss fight, how dare you! Yeah, this is going to be a slow fight, people. Not as slow as it could have been. It could be four times slower than it is now, but it's going to be a slow fight for what it is. Like, they're killing him pretty fast. <laughs> the game does not know that, though. <laughs> I guess a pop, there's just so many extra ones lingering. I'm placing bombs down on occasion here. I don't know if they're doing much. Okay, it's finally catching up in the time where he's disappeared. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna run into him and speed this up a little bit with some fires. Didn't actually speed it up that much at all. Guess I'm just going to run around and collect coins to, to carry on my mini Isaac army. It's going to be a two-face about the looks of it. Oh wait, maybe not, maybe not. He's only just started this. That's some good damage. One phase, one phase, one phase. Yes, one phase. Okay, that makes our life a bit easier. Right, as much as I love it, one second. For this last floor, we're going to remove Head of the Keeper. Just to speed it up a little bit. <laughs> as, as fun as that is. Get out of here, you. <gasps> Tech point five. I don't even know if that'll work, actually. Bag of crafting, potentially interesting, but unfortunately, it's not this. Whoa! Worm fellas, hello. That's a, a heckin' lot of worms. Get out of here, you. You know you're dead. Sadly, no chest. Some of these enemies are taking way longer to kill than I thought they would, but... Not awful. And the mini Isaacs, I don't know, maybe they do get increased health, because they're surviving more than I thought they would too. It's intriguing, I'll tell you that, it's intriguing. This wax item is OP, man. So enemies just don't get a chance to do anything, because they're just waxed all the time. And then they leave a fire behind, and anything they spawn on death also dies straight away. Yeah, I knew you were coming. Wow. Think about how the first time around that we killed him, and that time, so much faster. Oh, ho, 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 boy. That is a big old frog as well. Big old frog. Item, item, item. Aww. 
It's depressing. We're just not getting items at all. Also, our mini Isaacs are diminishing, so I expect our boss fight's going to be not the easiest in the world. I think getting there is just going to be a challenge, to be fair. Oh, no. Okay, we're good. We're good. But the boss fight's not going to be the easiest in the world because we don't have the biggest army. Luckily, we have a lot of health to work with for getting hit to release fires and more mini Isaacs. We don't have the largest army here, so... I don't know how this is going to go. I think he'll kill them pretty much instantly if he touches them, so... Got a half heart there, that's good. They've done good so far, phase one was, was pretty easy. But yeah, this has been more of a challenge than I expected. Like, putting the blindfold on obviously definitely made it a lot harder. It's, it's been an interesting one, though. It's been a lot of fun. I, I do I do love mini Isaacs. So anything I can do to make them even more fun is uh, always interesting. And this this run really highlighted that. They, they went wild. They went wild on this day. And we've got the last phase here. I think we've got plenty of mini Isaacs for last phase, to be honest. I think we should be good. And the, the melting wax thing is slowing down the boss, too, and freezing him on occasion. So, yeah, it actually was pretty easy. Either way, I hope you guys did enjoy that one. That was a lot of fun. And yeah, I will see you guys in the next one. Because that was, that was just, oh, that was beautiful. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys in the next one.